Ecclesiastes 8.8 8 says, As no one is discharged in time of war, so wickedness will not release those who practice it. The world tries to convince us that sin isn't all that bad. It's just a little naughty. It's like fine wine or chocolate. If you had a ton of it, that would be bad. But if you just dabble in it a little bit, that can be pretty nice. If we think like this, we're forgetting who God really is. He is holy. He is just. He knows our thoughts as they go through our mind. Do we really think that we can intentionally sin against Him and then in the, and then in the next moment ask for forgiveness? That'd be like me slapping you hard across your face and then saying, I'm so sorry, please forgive me. You'd know that I wasn't genuine. How come we think God doesn't know the same thing? No, the world tries to convince us that sin isn't a big deal and that there's always time for repentance and forgiveness tomorrow. Problem is, sometimes there isn't a tomorrow. And sometimes sin doesn't let go. As no one is discharged in time of war, so wickedness will not release those who practice it. If we know what Jesus did on the cross, what he had to endure to take our sins away, how he suffered in our place and how he died our death, we should know that sin is never casual, because what he had to do to take our sin away wasn't casual. Maybe you've got sins on your heart, intentional sins. Bring them to God. But don't bring them to Him thinking that God's so stupid that He'll forgive you. Bring them to Him with a heart of repentance that says, Lord, I'm a sinner, but you are so good and your promises are so sure that I know in Christ I must be forgiven.